So I've noticed the more content we publish, the more money we're gonna be able to generate. For example, today I've already made just over $500. This had came from work that I'd previously done. So I just wanna talk about a few things that you need to realize if you wanna succeed in affiliate marketing. This is literally everything you need to know to build a solid, successful online affiliate marketing business that can generate you 10K plus per month. And as you know, there's no limit on how much you can earn. The more work and effort you put into your business, the quicker you're gonna be able to see results. So I'm gonna talk about a few important things that you need to implement. And once you understand everything, you can simply put it into action. And I've created a six step video guide completely free for you to go ahead and watch. So you can start putting this into action and start bringing in an income for yourself so you can have more time and financial independence and simply live your dream lifestyle. In this video, I wanna talk about how to select a profitable niche. I wanna talk about branding, which is really important. I also wanna talk about funnel building. I wanna talk about email marketing. And I also wanna talk about content creation. When you start affiliate marketing, the key to success is shifting from being a consumer to becoming a producer, creating content and promoting digital products. So here's why this is important. As a consumer, you're just spending time and money. But as a producer, you're using your time to build, whether it's creating helpful videos, writing blog posts, or sharing valuable information. This way, you're not just consuming other people's content. You're adding value to the marketplace. And the more value you add to the marketplace, the more money you're gonna be able to make and simply helping others. And in return, you can make money when people trust your recommendations and buy the products you promote. In simple terms, to succeed, focus on producing content. Content that helps others, not just using the products. This shift in mindset will help you grow your audience, build trust and increase your income. And you don't need to be a massive influencer. You only need 1000 true fans to be able to make five figures per month. Now I personally don't have a huge following whatsoever, but I still make a decent amount of income, anything from three to $500 per day. But like I said, your income grows over time. And I've only been doing this for around two years and I only started taking it seriously one year ago. I don't work a full-time job, I only work on my online business every single day to help me grow my income even faster. And I wanna be able to help you do the same. First things first, let's talk about the niche. A niche is a specific area or a topic that you wanna talk about and share with your audience when promoting products and services. It's like picking a small corner from a big market where you can become an expert. Instead of trying to sell everything to everyone, you focus on a smaller group of people who are interested in the offer that you're promoting. This makes it easier to attract the right audience and sell products that match their needs. For example, I typically like to focus on promoting digital products as opposed to physical products. With physical products, because there is a manufacturing process, your profit margins are really small. And people are spending more money on digital products and is expected to grow to 74 billion by the end of year 2025. And this is because online learning is growing at such a fast pace. And since digital marketing is also expected to grow to 1.5 trillion by, by the end of year 2030, promoting digital marketing education is definitely a great idea. This is what I focus on doing because there is a huge market for it. There is a demand for people wanting to learn these skills. And when people learn digital marketing, they can promote and sell anything online. So you're tapping into a growing niche where people are willing to invest into their education. And this makes it a profitable area to focus on. So if you're new to affiliate marketing, you don't really understand the concept, let me just quickly break it down for you. So you've got big companies like Airbnb, Uber, and Expedia. None of those companies own services. Airbnb do not own any apartments. Uber do not own any cars. Expedia do not own any airplanes. What they're simply doing is connecting consumers to these services and when they do that, they get paid a commission for it. So we can take the same concept and apply it to digital marketing. Promote other people's products and services and also get paid a commission for it. And we do that by advertising online. But we'll get into the advertising side of things in a moment. Let's just quickly talk about branding and how important it is. For affiliate marketers, having a strong brand is important because it helps you stand out from the rest of the marketplace. It builds trust and attracts more loyal followers. When people recognize and trust your brand, they're more likely to listen to your recommendations and buy the products that you promote. This makes it easier for anyone who's building a brand to grow their audience and increase their earnings. Now, if we look at a few examples on Instagram, you can see one from the biz mom, Ariana. She focuses on helping people to make money online, work from home, and help people fire their boss. And she's mainly focusing on targeting parents, people who have kids. So when you're building a brand online, this could be a personal brand, it could be a product brand, or it could be a business brand. And your bio could be a reflection of you. If you have children, and if you're a mum or a dad, your bio could be something like, 
helping parents make money online, work from home, etc, etc. You could also go over to Instagram or any social platform, search for your niche. For example, we can go to the search bar and search for digital marketing. Many accounts are going to pop up. You can see what they've got in their bio. Look at popular accounts with over 300,000 followers and you can take inspiration from their accounts. And you can also use ChatGPT to help you come up with a brand name. I'll use my personal name across many different social platforms. On YouTube, I'm also known as the Smart Affiliate, but I've also got my name on my YouTube banner. And my bio says something like, helping ordinary people make money online and live their dream lifestyle. Now let's talk about the importance of having a funnel in place. A funnel is important for affiliate marketers because it helps turn people who are just interested in a product to actual buyers. Instead of sending people directly to the link of the product and hoping that they buy, a funnel guides them step by step through a sales process and all the selling is done for you. This builds trust and it shows your consumer why this product is valuable to them and how it can help solve their problem. Funnel is also known as a system which simply stands for save yourself time, energy and money. Once you set the system up, this will do all the selling and telling for you on complete autopilot which can give you the ability to make money while you're asleep whether you're out with your family and friends, your business is still generating income for you. You only need to set this up the one time. All we really need to focus on is producing content, advertising our business online, so we can get as much traffic as we can to that funnel, to visitors, to potential buyers. And a funnel also gives the ability to collect emails. And this is crucial because unlike social media, you don't own your followers on those platforms. Social media accounts can be deleted or restricted but your email list is yours. The more people you have on your email list, the more potential customers you can reach directly, meaning more chance to make money. Emails let you build a relationship with your audience, share valuable content and promote products over time. Now let's quickly talk about email marketing. When you're sending out these emails to your audience, to your subscribers, to your list, Without coming across too salesy, you want to keep your message natural and helpful. You want to start off with a friendly tone. Write your emails out as if you're talking to a friend. Start with a casual greeting, for example, hi, their name. I wanted to share something I've been loving lately, something, something like that. And focus on value. Explain how the product help you or is helping you, not just as features. Because we need to understand people do not buy products they buy a solution to their problem. People are looking for a transformation. For example, it could say something like, this program has made my life so much easier and it might help you too. It's helping me achieve more time and financial independence, which gives me the ability to spend more time with my loved ones, with my children. I can work when I want. It gives me more flexibility. I don't have to answer to a boss anymore. And this is just another example. And you wanna also be transparent. Mention the affiliate link honestly showing that you believe in the product. An example could be, just so you know, this is an affiliate link, I only recommend what I use. And this is something I also wanna talk about, is don't promote products that you don't personally own. Be the product of the product. People are more likely to trust your recommendations when you actually own the product yourself. Me personally, I only promote products to my audience that I personally own and I use myself and I believe in. When it comes to email marketing, telling stories is also a good way to build trust and relationship with your subscribers. And you also wanna give them a choice. Let them decide without pressure. People love to buy, but they hate to be sold to. Example could be, this may or may not be something for you, but here is the link if you wanna check it out. You wanna keep your emails helpful and relatable, so it feels like advice and not just a hard sell. Now let's talk about the content creation side of things. You can create content without showing your face, or you can simply talk to the camera like this. Both methods work. But I believe when you show your face, people are more likely to trust you quicker because they know you're a real human being. And I obviously understand that a lot of people, they fear from this and they're camera shy. The only way to overcome your fear is by simply practicing every single day. Remember, everyone starts from zero. The way to create content is by searching popular accounts in your niche. This could be on Instagram or TikTok. And what you want to do is you want to look at their most viewed videos, look at their comments, look at their engagements, and you simply want to go ahead and recreate that content. Now on my YouTube channel, if you click on playlists, you're going to come across faceless affiliate marketing. This teaches you different ways you can create content without showing your face. If you also want to learn how to put this into action, I've created a free six step video guide so you can start consistently achieving 10K plus per month selling digital products online using simple seven second videos. 
This is exactly what I do to get results in my business every single day. And all you need to do to get access to that is go over to my YouTube channel and then just click the link right at the top. This will give you instant access. If you do have any further questions, let me know in the comments below. With that being said, smash the like button and appreciation. Subscribe if you haven't already as I upload content consistently to help you make money online with affiliate marketing. Hit the bell icon so you're notified of all future content while I do upload it. With that being said, I'll see you in the next video. Take care, God bless and bye-bye for now.